Hey everyone, good morning or good night. So this is Light of the Darkness, episode 7, entitled True Love, part 1. Now, this is a topic most of you might be most interested in. And I'm going to break it up into at least maybe four, maybe five parts. So true love, what is love? Is love a four-letter word? Is it a chemical reaction that makes us do crazy things? Well, I can tell that love is so, so much more. Love is a thing that binds us all together. It's what gives us that hope that we often lose in humanity. Love is the change that we all need to become the best version of our best self. Love is actually the answer to many of life's interesting questions. And if you are not able to find an experience and tap into that real authentic love, I can guarantee you that you are definitely missing out on a lot of things in your life. Now, as a young person, I haven't had that much experience um, experience in real true love. But I can tell you, I have had moments where I've gotten glimpses and just a little, a little feeling of it. And I can tell you, that is more addictive than any drug you can ever imagine you can overdose on many things but once you get tapped into that real true authentic love it will transform the darkest of hearts it can soften the hardest of minds it can make the sharpest and smartest person become uh, crazy or dim-witted and love is something that many of us need for some persons who might suffer from depression and anxiety or might even have struggles feeling lonely, I can tell you just having that one person say and show you that love. Saying I love you is one thing, but seeing it and feeling it and experiencing it, it's, it's just something wonderful. And I can tell you this, if you've ever been in love, I'm telling you, if you've gotten your heart broken, that love can rekindle that fire that was put out by someone who didn't appreciate you the way that they should. That person who took you for granted, whether it's a, a spouse or a girlfriend, a boyfriend, a family member, a friend, whoever it may be. If you've experienced that real, true, authentic love, it doesn't matter what that person does do to you. It doesn't matter what they've said to you. The love can actually give you that strength and that drive to even open up your heart once more to forgive. Many of us, we hear the saying, forgive and forget. But I can tell you, once you have that real true experience where you've experienced true love, it, it will transform your life in so many ways. You will actually be a much better person because I'm telling you, if you're walking in love, if you're living by that real true love that we often hear about not the love that you see in movies and tv shows and that hollywood version no that's watered down that's just trying to justify crazy things that people do because they're either lusting or they like somebody and yes those are two other full letter words that we often confuse with love sometimes you like someone and because you think it's more than like you say i love the person Sometimes it's lust where you're just physically attracted to the person, whether the person's appearance, their personality, what they have, um, how they carry themselves, how they speak. You lust after that person and you confuse the lust with love and you say, I love you. And then when that love is put to the test and you really have to put in the work and the effort, you see that it was never love from the beginning. So... Let me ask you this question. Have you ever experienced or felt real, true, authentic love? Tell me in the comments below. And remember, don't forget to love. Love is the answer that we need. Love is all that we should strive to achieve. Because through love, you can achieve so much. Through love, you can actually find your purpose. Through love, you'd have that heart to forgive. Through love, you'd be able to get the strength you need to accomplish what you need in this life. Light of the darkness, live in love, check out for your neighbor, 
don't be selfish. Have a wonderful day.